Okay, hello everyone. Welcome to the latest tutorial for online presentation software called 280slides.com. What we're going to do today is I'm going to show you how to create an account, add some pictures and text, make an embeddable slideshow, and post it on Emoto. Once you go on to 280slides.com, click on Try It Now for free. The sign is then going to ask you if you want to create a save or open one. Um, we're going to make a create a new one, pick a template. OK. And the way the site works is that you're not going to be able to upload your pictures until you create your account first. So you want to make sure you hit the login button up front. So we're going to click on login. And for your case, you need to click on register, use an email, come up with a password. I'd recommend use your Edmodo password, type that stuff in and then hit register afterwards. Our next step is we want to start adding some pictures to our site. So click on the pictures button and you can uh, search their library for pictures if you have any stored and you could search the web by typing in something there but we want to upload all of our pictures. So let's click on the upload button and that's going to open up a separate browser window for you. Once you know where your files have been found or stored you have to click on one at a time click on open and it's then going to process it. Just in case for some reason you're having an issue of uploading your picture from a file you can also do the enter URL code. In order to get the URL code of a picture you need to go to a site such as on my poster site, find a picture and then go to download full size. Once you have the picture right click on it and you want to copy the image URL. Depending on what browser you're using, you can also uh, right click and go to the copy image location, depending on what you use. And then I'm going to Control V, or I can right click and paste, and then press Enter. And then that picture will be uploaded as well. If I want to add another slide, I'm just going to hit the New button off to the side here. And just like it says, double click to add your text. Type in, you know, I don't know, paper mache. Um, you look on over here. This is where you can change the, the font style. How big do you want it? You're probably going to have to highlight it all first in order to change it. And uh, even the color, too. You can make it bold. You can line it left, right move it around, do whatever you got to do, but those are your text options. If I want a picture that I have downloaded, I'm just going to drag that over and let go. And then all I have to do is just change the size of the handlebars and I can change it around that way. Basically, each slide should be a different step in the progress of that you've been doing. And then when you're ready, you hit new and you make a new one. I would also recommend for you save frequently. Go to save as and call it your name and hit OK. Just in case you get kicked out of the site. When I have all my information ready to go, I'm going to click on share. And then you want to select link and embed to your presentation. And you want to select anybody. Sometimes all this info doesn't come on up. So what I have to do is I hit done and I click on share again and go through the process and then you're going to get that embed code. You need to get this embed code to put it on Emoto. Double click on it so it's all blue and then copy it by right clicking. And then we're going to go to Edmodo. Once I'm in Emoto, I'm just going to go up top. I'm going to say here is my slide. You go to link and we're now going to right click and paste Hit the tab key on your keyboard and call it uh, presentation. Hit attach. And then know who you're sending to. Send it to your class so the whole class can see it. And then hit send. You can click on the actual show to see if it came through. By clicking on it, so I'm just going to click on the blue words and it'll automatically come up. And all I gotta do is click and it goes on. Boom, you're all done. Good luck.